bad. This is the excellent sorry of the world. Run, spot, run. Out, damn, spot. <laughs> <laughs> bad. Players are a young theater company formed in spring of 2010. We specialize in producing classical and historically relevant works and making them accessible to modern audiences. Our first production, an 18th century comedy, The Busybody by Susanna Sunlieber, was performed in August 2010 in Fort Triumph. Well, bent quill means... Sort of an allegory for... Things, things being able to change and adapt and bend rather than break. It's a bit like a fractured fairy tale. It's it's a it's a little bit off. It's going to be a little bit different than it was originally. It can have whatever meaning that you want to take it as. It could be that you know we're a little kooky. I have no idea. They had managed within the movie to create this moment. It was so fantastic because the theater erupted in applause. It, it was a moment where the movie could pretend to be live theater. At that point, I had grown my first beard, my first 14-year-old beard, and a young child, maybe six or seven, in the middle of one of my monologues, stands up and points and says, Ma, look, the bearded lady. Uh, and, you know, that's never going to happen in a, in a film. And there's something about live theater, and especially live theater outdoors that I find to be unique. It was just really fun to, to do a Shakespeare with all female, which was, you know, it's kind of a reverse of the all male versions. And it was a great experience all around. Well, it definitely solidified the fact that I love classical theater, and it definitely solidified the fact that you could do theater anywhere and, and create a world in any sort of space. I was sitting just on this lawn watching this production and she started to go into monologue and it, it was one of those moments where I just felt like oh my god like she's looking at me like she's talking to me and then after the show I, I came up to her to like tell her how great I thought her production was she was like oh thank you for letting me use you in that scene and she actually had been talking to me. I think that there's a need for theater and live theater. The opportunity to craft those kind of moments exists through the entire show. Classical theater is, I think, always relevant to a modern audience because there are certain things that we as humans just can't get away from. You know, there's always the theme of love, the conflict, betrayal, confusion, sex, situations beyond our control, and we're striving for answers. The relationships are going to stay the same, and the struggles are going to stay the same. Those things can provide us a window into another place and time and culture when I read a classical text and I connect with something in that, for me, that's no different from me reading a, a modern text. Just because the text is old doesn't mean that the production is. I think that's part of what I really love about classical theater. There is an opportunity in looking back to recognize what hasn't changed and what has. My personal goals for the for Bent Quill players... Oh, ah, that's easy. Good work. For modern audience to learn a little bit more about the time period. Be reaching people. You know, we want people to be more involved. It makes people feel more comfortable with classical texts that they might not be exposed to on a daily basis. I'm really excited to see what we get.